my Wee Reapers kennel. I have a portable air conditioner in the background. Oh my goodness. I love it <laughs> so much. It's been incredibly hot here for two weeks. Oh my, like warm from where I am. I mean, I'm from Northern Canada and we had temperatures of like plus 34, 35, 36, 37 with the humidity and it's unbearable to me. In fact, it's so unbearable, I cut my hair. Yeah. <laughs> I love this new AC because it comes with a remote and this is as cold as it can get, 64 degrees. So to me, that's nice. I'll just turn it off so you can hear me. Today I have Noel Tannen. He is the leaf, the real born leaf sculpt. And I wish you could see the details. He is painted. I don't know if you can see those red blotches. He is like, and he has painted hair. He is so sweet to look at. Um, but here's his body, his feet. He was reborn by Holly of Precious Paths, and I bought him secondhand from a friend of mine. Um, my friend, Cassandra, who I bought this, I bought a lot of dolls from Cassandra. Um, I don't think she's in the hobby anymore because um, she has real babies now. So congratulations to Cassandra. Um, I know that she kept going from like reborns to other type of dolls, like not the masterpiece, but the, um, I forget what they're called. It's, it's been many years now since she's been around in the hobby. But if you are around Cassandra, I still have all the babies that you sold me, and I love this little guy. I named him Noel Tannen because he is a Christmas baby, and he is so, oh, you guys, this hobby is so amazing. You just look at them, and they're so peaceful, so peaceful. I came on to share with you a small haul that I received from Timu. Okay, I'll, I have to lay them down gently and I'll be right back. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> Timu is an online shopping from China. It's much like AliExpress or Wish, um, Shen. Shen, Shen, <laughs> S-H-E-I-N, Shen, um, in French I would say Shen, but, um, <laughs> Timu has been so addicting for me. I've been buying things for my lunch boxes, for my, um, like, tumblers, ice tumblers, amazing products. Everything I've bought from there, I love kitchen products. Um, pizza pans, like the deep dish, I love them. And then I thought, why not for the hobby? I never even thought of it until, um, a few of my Reborn friends have been posting that they've been buying things for the hobby from Timu. And I thought, hmm, I wonder what kind of stuff they have. So I would love to share with you some of the things. And I didn't open these yet either. So... <laughs> Let's see. I did buy some pacifiers, and I know a lot of you know that I have a huge collection of pacifiers. I had so much fun with my, um, what do they call it, passy scoops. <laughs> I love that. I will link my passy scoops playlist, and um, I have an idea for that. I would love to play that game again in the summer. I only have 15 more days of school. That's it. And then I'm on summer holidays, so I can't wait for that. Okay. <clears throat> A few things in here I bought for my pet reborns. I do have an orangutan reborn. 
uh, and I do have a pug reborn that was gifted to me from Kelly. And I miss Kelly a lot. Hi, Kelly, if you're watching. So, but let's just see. I did, okay, what should I show first? I have it in my lab. Okay, let's, oh no, I don't want everything to fall on the floor because my lap isn't that big for everything okay let's see what these these are some silicone passies that i almost bought from like amazon but they're so expensive but on timu these are only like two dollars canadian it'd be cheaper than american Ooh. So I did buy some unique colors. I wanted, I'm judging by my hairstyle and my clothes I'm wearing. I am inspired by boho accessories. And as you know, I've made some passy clips boho inspired macrame. I've discovered that, using that word so much, discovered, but macrame, I am enjoying a lot and i thought that this color the earth tone would be beautiful with my boho passy clips that i make so here's one color by the way i do have like this kind of stuff i made i made this baby rattle from jute and uh those are just i bought these rings from amazon a long time ago but I'm talking about like these I make these and I do have a tutorial on now see this one here I spent full price to me this cost me $17 <laughs> that's a lot for me so that was one oh, all these things are falling okay here's another one in here I forget what color oh People are asking me, like, how long does Timu come in? Um, it depends. The very first time I ordered from Timu, it was a very fast, like, within a week. It's because they do have a warehouse in Canada, in Ontario. And, um, but I know since it's becoming more and more popular, it's been taking longer to get to me. But I still love it. Oh, I like this color. So here's, like... I have no idea. Dusty orange, even no, it's even darker. It's like a light brown. <clears throat> what was that? Oh, and I have to go and pick up Francis for lunch very soon, so I'm trying to do this fast. Um, I wanted to try and buy colors that I don't have already owned and colors that are earth tone for my hobby, for my boho hobby. And I do want to change my nursery room into one. So here's like a dark, dusty mustard color. And yes, I will use a food to describe the colors. <laughs> that's just, that's just something said a long time ago. I've heard the words, um, who uses food to describe? things i knew and this one this is i wanted to get like a pure round one but they didn't have any left but i thought this one would look cute too with a, a vintage style so i got that and i think that's it for the passies this time oh no there's one more one more Comes in. I go leaving five minutes. Ooh, this one is a pretty color. It's a dusty rose. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just trying to open it. How come when you're in a hurry, it seems like you just fumble more? <laughs> How come? Oh my goodness, I want to open this. Where's the opening?
I can't believe. Okay. No matter. I'm going to see what I was going to say. Look at this. A very beautiful color. It's a dusty rose. And it's gorgeous. <gasps> I love this color. Ooh, I'm so happy. Okay. Now, I bought. I thought I bought. I bought three of these. I have a blue one. I don't know where it went. Okay. Oh, wait. Things did fall out of my lap. I knew I bought another one. It's a blue. So I want. I purposely wanted like a girl and boy for twins. But look at this gorgeous. Is it gray? But there's a hint of a, a blue in there. A type of blue. I love them. It's gorgeous. I love them. Okay. Um, for this is, I'll just quickly show you. This is Baby. She is my pug reborn by a Bountiful Baby. Yes, she was gifted to me. <laughs> and her name is Baby. Thanks to my viewers who suggested that name for me. And I do have, sorry, I do have an orangutan. And her name is Chloe. Chloe from, um, she's named after Clyde from the movie uh, Everywhere But Loose. Oh, she's so cute. I I owned her the longest in my collection, and I never spent time with her. There was a time in this hobby that I was um, um, obsessed with monkeys. <laughs> Monkey things. But isn't she beautiful? Chloe. So for the babes, for the pets, um, I never, ever owned a pet bottle so i got this from timu it's um a pet bottle it's for cats and dogs since i think it's a real one but very tiny is for newborns like when they're very tiny but i just got pick one up for the hobby it's so cute i did buy pink because both my pets are females and then look what else they have. They have these puppy, puppy covered diapers. <laughs> I did open one already. I didn't try it on yet, but I did open one because I really wanted to see. Um, <laughs> I wanted to see the tail part. And look, they have little frills on them. But I got a yellow, a blue, and this pink. So I opened up the blue one, and the blue one also has cute little frill. So I can't wait to try these. So yeah, these are on their pet. <laughs> and these are the smallest ones that they have. They have like size extra small, small, and like, I, I forget. I just picked the smallest. So I'm hoping that they will fit. Now, I also picked up, these are muslin washcloths for babies. I picked up these colors, pink, a blue, and a white, purposely just for, what time is it? Ah, uh, purposely just for pictures because they won't be big enough. At least, I don't know. Let's see how big they are. I have no idea. I never opened them yet. Oh, they're so soft. So, yeah, they're just like a washcloth. But I thought that they would be a really cute accessory. Like with the bottles. Like even like if you just have it like this. Oh, they're so soft. And they're thick. They're, I don't know if you can tell. So, yay, I got white, blue, and pink. Okay, before I go on, before, um, oh, these are for my nails. I used to wear nail jewelry back in the day, like little, like diamond, and then you, to keep them on, you would just nail polish over them. 
So these are really small and really tiny. They're not exactly diamond looking. The ones I used, oh yeah, they are. I was looking at the back. I was looking at this side. But you just put them on your nails and you nail polish over them and decorate them. I used to wear nail polish all the time. Okay. Oh, and last video I've done. And sorry I didn't come on the next day. Uh, I have family around. Uh, right now they're not home, but I have to get Francis from work. Um, <laughs> blah, blah, blah. As you know, I do macrame these beautiful passy clips. And, um... I've made, like, I buy these from Amazon, and I buy the beans from either the dollar store, yeah, mostly the dollar store, or Amazon, but the dollar store. But, um, now, and here's another one with a jute, but I ran out of those wooden round passy uh, clips, but I do have lots of these kind. I tried to do a passy on here. Um, I do have many of these. So what I thought would look really gorgeous is, um, they fell on me, where are they? I found, oh, <laughs> I found these buttons at the dollar store and I thought that they would look really cute if I hot glued them on and made passy clips but look at these different and they were in my dollarama they were $1.75 Canadian but they are so pretty and they're so perfect for the theme that I would love to have in my nursery a boho outdoor theme. What time is it? Ah, and one more thing I got at the dollar store. So these are also some beads. Mostly I wanted the earth tones. So these are perfect to make into passy clips and to make more of like rattles for, or I also made a rattle before of like all beans or yeah, all wooden beads and some of these on it before. So I gifted them away though, but I mean, I'm so excited to try out new projects. And oh, see, and I mean stuff like this. This is a boho. I have other colors in this. So, anyways, guys, sorry for the rambling. Um, yeah, I have to go. With, uh, I really have to go. I hope that you guys are having a great day. I love you guys. I can't wait to be here more often in the summer. Um, yeah, I have, I want to do past these scoops again. I want to, um, I want to get a permanent job. My term teaching ends June 30th. And after that, I'm be looking for new employment. So please wish good for me because, um, I want to get back to doing some secret giveaways. Um, they're a lot of fun. Oh, and speaking of, I have... Okay, I don't have time. I have an idea I want to share with you guys very soon. But yes, I have to go. Hope that you're doing well. Love you guys. Mad Love you guys and have a happy, happy day. Bye. Bye, guys. <laughs>